Okay, started up a little early. Get going. Seeing them offline, but I'm not. Okay, we're good. One time viewers. Okay. Wait a minute or two. Um, in case anybody wants to come in, see the results of the big game. Yes, I do. I um, I was able to find a copy of the big game before they're gonna air it tonight. It's sort of like um, getting your hands on the Game of Thrones finale before. Um, everybody hated it. But, you know, whatever. It's all good. Nobody, Nobody's going to hate this Super Bowl, I don't think. Whoops. Okay. Yeah, just going to wait a couple minutes, see if people come in. Check out the big game, which I will be leaking in full. I do have a um, videotape copy of it, which I will be playing on the stream tonight. Or today. It's not nighttime. It's actually the middle of the day. It's noon right now. It's noon. Everyone's getting ready for the Super Bowl today. Um, but if you're one of my lucky viewers, you do not have to wait. I have the whole damn thing. Fox is kicking themselves in the ass. Fuck Fox. Fuck Disney. They messed up. Well, I, I guess the TV channel is just Fox now, but, but also fuck Disney. Little Mickey Mouse bullshit. Just waiting. Let's see if anybody else will come in. Double checking some stuff. Whoops, real quick. We have a viewer. Right, I'm going to wait until. We're going to wait two minutes from right now. Two minutes from now, the Super Bowl will be leaked in full. And, you know, all them higher-ups at the NFL, they're going to be cursing my name for the rest of their lives. They're going to say, I cannot believe Stevie Kuby leaked the best Super Bowl we've done so far. And then on their deathbeds, they're going to say, um, I cannot believe that he leaked that our best Super Bowl of all time. And um, I'll be honest, I have watched it. It's one of the craziest pieces of sports performance I've ever seen. I'm not a sports guy. You see me streaming video games. You give me a football, I call it a basketball. You give me a hockey puck, I call it a golf club. Okay? <laughs> it really is just... It's going to be so crazy. Um, you won't believe what happens. We, we have... First off, we have all four quarters. All four quarters will be displayed shortly. Not only do we have all four quarters, we have the halftime show. We have the halftime show in full. The full performance. And I'll be honest, I did you a favor. I cut out the commercials. I edited out every new commercial. You can see them on YouTube anyway. 
It doesn't matter. I'll, I'll, on the YouTube archive of the stream, I'll put links to every commercial. But, uh, I mean, if you really want to see Maya Rudolph pretending she's an Eminem or some shit, you can go watch that. You're not going to watch it here. This is only quality programming. Only quality programming here. Although it was great. They did. Uh, all right. I will tell you this. There was a trailer for. Are you ready for this? It's the sequel nobody expected. Tommy Boy 2. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> I still want the Super Bowl to get some viewers, so we'll let them have that. We'll let them have the Tommy Boy 2 trailer. CGI heavy. I will say that. Okay. Um, now that's been a couple minutes. I say we leak this baby. The police may come to my house. I may get arrested. I don't care. I'm doing this for you. The people. All right. Oh, the upload just completed. All right. I'll stream it right now. Good morning, Super Bowl heads. I'm your host for the Super Bowl this year. My name is Jackie Football. We have a Super Bowl. We have a great Super Bowl planned for you today. As you know, Philadelphia had to drop out. And so did the other guys. So we're going to be doing things a little differently this year. There will be three games played in full. There will be one game, half of a second game, then we will... Uh, have the halftime show. And it's a good one. Then <laughs> we will have the second half of the second game. Followed by the third game. Okay. Let's get this Super Bowl started. As we're all aware, the Eagles dropped out due to unforeseen circumstances. And their friends in Minnesota have decided or have offered to take their place. The first match will be Minnesota. Versus San Francisco. San Francisco kicks the ball. Wow. What a shot. The quarter... Uh, the running guy... Oh, he got knocked down. And uh, for today's Super Bowl, we do have... A, a very special... Uh, coach Cam... Oh, they fucked that one up. Um, okay. 
And they got another chance to do it. Oh, he threw the ball. Oh, he's running. To the 35 yard line. Oh, there's a struggle for the ball. And they get knocked down. Second down. Minnesota's still in control of the ball. It's a running play. Oh, the running man zags. First down at the some yard line. I missed which one it was. Oh. Almost a touchdown. The struggle for the ball. First down. We're almost to the end zone now. And he runs it in for a touchdown. Touchdown, Minnesota. Two of the players do a high five. What a beautiful day for sports. Oh. It's successful. Seven points to Minnesota. They return the ball and kick it really far. San Francisco is in control of the ball. Oh, on their first play, the quarterback has been sacked. This does not bode well for San Francisco. Oh, shit. Uh, the players forgot what was going on. And San Francisco has a first down. Let's see. What will San Francisco do next? Another first down for San Francisco. Oh, San Francisco gets a touchdown. Hooray for San Francisco. And they get the extra point. What a great day to be a San Franciscan. And a sports fan. 13 seconds left on the clock and Minnesota is attempting to return. They fall near the 25 yard. Quarterback has been sacked. Oh, and again. What is going on with Minnesota today? Don't they know they're playing in the Super Bowl? Oh. And that's the end of the first quarter of the first game. Minnesota is in possession of the ball. The score is tied, 
Wow, what a bad play. What a terrible idea. No coverage. Minnesota goes out of bounds. Oh, another bad running play. Oh, the ball has been intercepted by San Francisco. But Minnesota gets it back. Hmm. Oh, no. They're defending now. My bad. Oh, San Francisco may have this game. In the bag with another touchdown. The San Francisco players high five. Because they're so happy. And they get the extra point. So they'll probably high five again in the future. Minnesota attempts to run it back. And it's stopped at the 50-yard line. Oh, the quarterback decides not to throw the ball that time, but to throw everyone for a loop. Oh, Minnesota gets some yards on that one. What a great day to be a sports fan. Oh. The running back seem to have forgotten that they chose a running play for that one. Okay, um, he passed it to someone out of bounds. What a terrible idea. There we go. They got some. They got a first down. Let's see, what will Minnesota do next? Oh, the quarterback has been sacked. Oh, and the ball has been intercepted for a second time in the quarter. Does that happen frequently? I'm not sure. Oh, and without any coverage, San Francisco seems to have... Oh, at the last second, Minnesota takes him down. If Minnesota can keep this up... Perhaps... Oh, never mind. San Francisco is running away with this game. They try for the point, which they'll probably get. And I was correct. They got the point. A kick. A little kick. Taking penance on Minnesota. Oh, 
Oh, Minnesota makes probably one of their better plays this quarter. First down for Minnesota. One second left on the clock. They're going to have to make a very good play. And they don't because the ball has been intercepted once again. This is the halftime show for the first game. Again, our big halftime show is planned for the middle of the second game. Minnesota has decided to make all the wrong moves this game so far. Oh. oh, but they have decided to make an interception. Finally, something good for them. It's very cold this time of year in Minnesota. Perhaps their brains are lagging. I myself am stationed just outside of Disneyland. So after the game, I get to see Mickey Mouse. And what a great visit that will be. Minnesota taking their time with their next play. And it was a terrible choice. They thought too long. Oh, oh, Minnesota runs away with the ball. Can they make it? It's a touchdown. The Minnesotans high five. Possibly for the last time in the game with the way they're playing. And they get the extra point. Score, 14-21. San Francisco. The Minnesotans do a little kick. Let's see. What will Minnesota do now? What are they anticipating? From San Francisco. Oh, the quarterback almost gets sacked. But the other player decided to just do a circle around him. Perhaps to confuse him. You may see that a lot tonight, folks. Football is not just a game of physical prowess, but it's also a mind game. Many of the players hope that once you get in their head, the ball will be dropped and intercepted. San Francisco on their third down. This may be the first changing of the ball that we see. That wasn't preceded by a touchdown. 
Oh, they choose to take the field goal instead. It's good! San Francisco leads by 10. Minnesota starts from way back. Let's see what they do for their next play. 21 seconds left in the quarter. Successful pass, and they're at a first down. Another first down for Minnesota. 14 seconds to score before the end of the quarter. Minnesota zigzags down the field. Six seconds left on the clock with more than 20 yards to go. If they can pull a playoff like that again, they may score before the quarter is over. Oh, they have decided they'd rather do that with three seconds left on the clock. Let's see if that pays off for them. End zone in sight. Oh! Just before the end zone, Minnesota is taken down. We have entered the final quarter of the first game. San Francisco leads by 10. San Francisco uh, <laughs> does not make the block. Minnesota touchdowns. <laughs> Let's see if they get the extra point. I assume it's not very difficult, as every extra point has been earned today. It's good. Again. It usually is. Interception by Minnesota. What a great day to be a sports fan. Interception by San Francisco. What a great day to be a sports fan. I love football. Let's see. San Francisco forced to punt for the first time in the game. Hmm, what will Minnesota do? Oh, the quarterback seems to have forgotten they've chosen to do a running play.
as is what tends to happen. I'm going to start at the 30, or closing in on the 30, my apologies. Second down for Minnesota. Oh, the quarterback is sacked. Third down for Minnesota. Minnesota approaching the end zone. What will they do? It's a touchdown for Minnesota. The players are so happy they high five. And one is left hanging. Extra point. Oh, the extra point was not earned. And Minnesota meant to do a big kick. They did a little kick. Could this be the end of their run? San Francisco down. 16 seconds left on the clock. San Francisco could bring it back. And bring a win home for the Golden Gate Bridge. Yeah. And Venom also took place in San Francisco. 14 seconds left. Second down. First down. San Francisco almost scores. Nine seconds left. San Francisco in possession of the ball. First down. Closing in on the end zone. Oh! Touchdown from San Francisco. Minnesota may be out of the game. Let's see. The extra point is earned. Will Minnesota be able to run the ball all the way back? They are not. San Francisco wins 31 to 27. What a great first game for the Super Bowl. Just a reminder, this year's Super Bowl will have three games on account of the other teams not showing up. So we've decided to get some of the other guys. And, um... You know, just see what happens with that. It's going to be a great day to be a sports fan. And a great day to be a music fan. As during this game's halftime, our Super Bowl halftime show will take place. Originally... Rihanna was going to be the halftime show, but she also dropped out. Filling in for her will be Big Casey. Big Casey, the independent musician on the rise. What a great day to be a sports fan 
and a music fan. Just what a great day overall. Ignore this part. We are calibrating our computers. Our next matchup is Denver and Washington. They must be thrilled to take part in this Super Bowl. Oh, Denver accidentally selected a play without running it by everyone first. <laughs> so everybody was a little confused. Struggle for the ball. Denver's on their third down. They're going to have to make a good play here. <laughs> Oh, they made a bad play. The ball was intercepted. I'm sensing a lot of these games will be very similar. Let's see what Denver does now. Oh, Denver forgot they were not in possession of the ball anymore. Denver down at 30. Or uh, Washington. Oh, well, everyone's there at the 30. <clears throat> it's just that Washington has the ball. Oh, no coverage on the player over there. Why not? There's more than enough guys on the field. Oh, Washington does not make the touchdown quite yet. Although, they do have a couple more tries to do it. Passing complete. What is Washington doing? Oh, Washington down. They go for the field goal. It's incomplete. No good. This game is fucking crazy. Pardon my language. Oh, Denver accidentally selects a play again. But they get a first down. Everybody seems to be jiving. Let's see. Looks like Denver will be doing a passing play. First down. Good for them. Playing a lot better than Minnesota was against San Francisco. First down, Denver may get a touchdown in this first quarter. We'll just have to wait and see. Oh, 
Oh, Denver with a first down right at the end zone. I wonder what they'll do. They run it in for a touchdown. Denver! These players really love each other. There's a real camaraderie on the field. You can feel it, even from the booth. Oh, but there is a pathetic excuse for an extra point. It seems as though they can't kick. Oh, it looks like, oh, a touchdown for Washington. What a great day to be a sports fan. Will Washington get the extra point? Let's find out. They did while I was looking at my phone. One more quarter until our big halftime show. Everybody's really excited about it. Let's see. Struggle for the ball. Down at 35. Interception by Washington. And they get another touchdown. What a crazy game. 13-6, Washington. And they get the extra point, too. Yippee! for Washington. What a great day to be a sports fan. Let's see, what will Denver do next? Hmm. I can only assume their coach is carefully deciding. First down. Oh, third down. I misunderstood what was happening. I'm a little distracted. I'm too excited for the halftime show, which is coming up after the quarter. First down for Denver. Another first down for Denver. Another interception by Washington. <laughs> but they are taken down before they can get a touchdown. Oh. Never mind. They are getting a touchdown. Good for them. And they get the extra point, too. Just sort of the carry on top for the game. Thank you. 
Minnesota makes a full return for a touchdown. Uh, I'm sorry, they're Denver. I forgot. They try for the point. And it's good. Congratulations, Denver. And a great kick, too. Seven seconds left on the clock. Three seconds left on the clock. First down. And now it's time for the halftime show. Let's watch this little halftime show first. This is the prelude to our big Super Bowl halftime show. Hold on, they're gonna... Okay. Uh, we were trying to clear the field. But the teams will wait on the field while we get ready for our halftime show. Again, Rihanna decided not to come. She said, I don't want to play the Super Bowl anymore if the Eagles and Chiefs aren't there. We said, we understand. So we have up and coming independent artist Big Casey doing the show for us. He'll be doing a delightful medley of his many, many famous songs. If you've not heard of Big Casey, I don't blame you. He only has a couple downloads on SoundCloud. But I know him pretty well. He's my nephew. So enjoy my nephew's halftime show. What a great day to be a sports fan. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Big Casey here. Sorry, this is a bit of an emotional moment for me. I've uh I've been a huge fan of the Super Bowl ever since the first one. And I rewatch those every day. Um before we before we start the halftime show, I just want to say on the way to the stadium tonight, I stopped at a store and I bought a t-shirt and this is that t-shirt I love football oh shit hold on I'm checking a text from my dad he said congratulations oh shit oh shit <laughs> here we go My dad said congratulations, so I'm getting the halftime half show. I love football. I love pigskin. <laughs> I love sports. You love me. I love sports. I can't get enough of that all that jock stuff. Sports is my favorite thing ever since I ate that chicken wing back when we watched the Eagles play back in my hometown. We all got around the TV, ate Little Caesars pizza, it was greasy. 
and we had lots of fun. Sing along if you know the words. Cameraman, feel free to zoom in and out. Sorry, I missed a couple of verses, but uh, we're going to get right back into it. I love football. I love sports. I could choke a goat with a horse. I can kill you. <laughs> I am so strong. I'm wearing a thong. Having a good time at the game. We got nachos. At the game. We all cheer so loud. It was the loudest crowd I ever did found. Oh, next song. <laughs> what did you say to me before she left last night? We had an incredible fight. It just didn't seem right. I'm going crazy. I'm thinking about Maisie. Why did she say those things? Right before she left. Sorry, just a little move. Yeah, she said those things. She said them all to me. <laughs> yeah, she said those things. One after one. Yeah, she said those things. She said those things to me. Oh, and when I got home that night, I couldn't believe my ears. <laughs> what did I just hear? She told me, she told me, she told me, she told me, she told me. I can't even repeat what she said to me. It was the craziest thing. <laughs> Why did she say those things? Why did she say those things to me? I can't believe you said those things to me. Oh. I should have eaten something before I came up here to do the halftime show. Maybe a cameraman can get me a snack. I feel like I'm gonna puke if I keep dancing. Hold on, everybody, the song's gonna keep going because it's pre-recorded, but I did get pretty, I am pretty hungry. I want a snack. And the worst part is I forgot how the rest of the words to the song went. I was up here all week practicing. <laughs> oh, Gardettos, the perfect snack for being on stage. Oh, everybody's favorite official Super Bowl sponsor. Oh my god. Next song, y'all right? God, there is, is the snack of king. I like to make them and cook them. God, there is the snack of kings. I like to make them and cook them. to the store today what did i see on sale my favorite thing it was a big screen tv and it had high fidelity and lots of pixels for me to see sorry i'm blanking guys I'm blanking Everybody enjoying the big game tonight? Woo! I knew you say that. 
I'm going crazy because I'm thinking about that big screen. <laughs> I need to see that shit. That's the craziest shit I ever saw. Paw Patrol on the big screen TV. Rubble. Jeez. Marshall. A sky. Uh, and the other ones. This is going to be perfect for um, that Slime Time show that they show on Nickelodeon. That's why I had to do this song. I love Paw Patrol. Yeah, I love Paw Patrol. I love Paw Patrol. Yeah, I love Paw Patrol. Case, Sky, uh, Rubble, Marshall, all them guys. All the dogs. They're my real dogs, but you are my real dogs. I can't have a real dog. I'm allergic to dogs. I can't eat that dog. <laughs> I know you all know this one. Everybody get into it. Jump, froggy. Jump, froggy. Jump. Jump, froggy. Jump, froggy. Jump. Jump, froggy. Jump, froggy. Jump. Sorry, so a little emotional. You're hopping around like a little frog. I can't see you like I'm in a fog. Why are you going to try to throw down with me? Can't you see? I'm the best there ever was at my team. Jump, frog, jump. Jump, frog, jump. Jump, frog, jump. Jump, frog, jump. Hold on, everybody. I'm getting a text. It's from my dad. He said he loves me. <laughs> Everybody saw that guy try to fight me. And I beat him up. Fucked him up. Oh. I messed him up. I love being here at the Super Bowl. <laughs> I didn't like that song anyway. I love football funky mix. You know I love it. What say you come over to my place and we'll watch the football game? Yeah. <laughs> no, it's not time for the grand finale yet. It's alright, after this the next song will be, is our grand finale. I got a hair caught in my throat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love it. Everybody loves a football game. Yeah, everybody loves a football game. You got to see those guys smack each other around. Hope nobody gets a concussion at tonight's game. Or nobody's heart stops. Yeah. Did you hear about that shit? 
some guy died on the field <laughs> and they had to wheel him away, but I guess they helped him out or whatever. Football is my favorite dangerous game. I love seeing those guys crack their skulls in half just for my fancy football league. Who's, who's everyone's favorite fantasy football player? Is it Dan Marino? What about... Uh, what's my... What's another favorite football player of mine? Cole Pepper? Ocho Cinco! And of course, Wayne Gretzky. Oh, and we can't forget our dearly departed, um, who's it? Pele. He loved football. And he, he's a huge guy. So he just rammed into everyone. He's the world's greatest football player. And, um, see how I'm doing on time? Okay, this next song is going to be my tribute to Pele our greatest football player we lost this year. We love you, Pele. We miss you, too. We love you, Pele. We miss you, too. We love you, Pele. Miss you, too. We <laughs> miss you, too. I miss the way you ran that ball around the field. And I... I can't believe you're gone from us. Pele, where did you go? Will we ever find you? I don't. I can't believe that you are gone. And I can't believe that I'm singing this song. Because I shouldn't have to sing a song for missing Pele so much. He should still be here today at the game with us. Pele. Pele, Pele, checking the, uh, what the Finale. We miss you, Pele. God, I miss you, Pele. Miss so much. I can't believe that mouse dancing on my phone screen. It could not have predicted that would happen to me. We miss you, Pele. We miss you so much. Greatest football player ever. God damn, I miss your ass. God damn it, Pele. I miss you so much. This is my tribute song to Pele. Wow, what a fantastic halftime show. Big Casey, he's going places, folks. Um, I'm very proud to call him my nephew. All right, let's get back to the game. Players still on the field preparing to return the ball. All that waiting really messed with their heads. Uh, let's do a little recap because that was a pretty long um, <laughs> halftime show. Washington, Denver. Washington leads 21 to 13. Washington in possession of the ball. First down. Ready, 
Another first down. Denver is not playing like they want to win the second game in the Super Bowl. Oh, some of these Denver players have no idea what's going on. I swear. I guess I should remain impartial, but what are you going to do? Washington misses the extra point. Denver gets the ball. Washington leads by 14. Oh, an interception by Washington. <laughs> Excuse me. I had too many salty snacks during the halftime show. Second down for Washington. <sighs> Second down for Washington again. Oh, Washington gets the touchdown. Hooray for Washington. We love Washington. It's good. They get the extra point. Denver has to get some major points coming up. Otherwise, they won't get to have a good day. And all their friends will make fun of them. First down at the 50-ish. First down. Both teams playing like they really want it this year. Oh, an interception again by Washington. They should change their names to the Interceptors. And Denver should change their names into the Intercept Eds. Because it's happening... Much too often. Oh.
Oh, Denver gets to choose their something now. Um, that one. Oh, change sides. Here we go. Oh, what a bad play. They haven't had the ball in so long, they kind of forgot what to do. You're supposed to throw the ball. You silly football players. Um, somehow I missed that we're in the fourth quarter now. Sorry. What? Okay. They didn't play good enough, and they're going to try for a field goal. Wait. No. No, they're going to try to pass it. And they get a first down. They almost tried to kick a field goal from there. What? A bunch of funny football players. Football is the funniest sport. Followed closely by across Denver gets a touchdown players are so happy they high five and we got it on our high definition cameras everyone's happy now Let's see. Here we go. Okay, I guess you can't hit the quarterback when they're getting ready to throw the ball. For whatever reason. They got him, don't worry. Let's see. We'll do this one. Thirty seconds left on the clock. Washington gets another touchdown. Hooray for Washington! They try for the extra point. They don't get it. Denver running back. The ball. Zigzagging across the field. Oh, they are taken down at the 40. Will they be able to get 20 points in the next 13 seconds? I doubt it. And that's not a good sign. It looks like Denver may lose. 
but Washington will live on in the glory of this very strange Super Bowl 57. First down. Six seconds left on the clock. Denver, come on. At least get another point. They look like fools. And the game's over. Washington wins with twice as many points as the other guys. We're all ready for the big third game. And I was lying before. It was always going to be the Eagles and the Chiefs. However, they dropped out again. So, um, we actually don't have anything planned for this final part. Uh, my producers are telling me to improvise. Hmm, what should I do? I have an idea. Let's see if I can find it. Yes, there it is. We'll just play my old copy of Pac-Man. We can all pretend it's a Super Bowl. I think that will be a lot more fun. Let's see. Where's my Pac-Man? There it is. Everyone here at NFL Sports loves Pac-Man. So they said it's okay for me to do this. Look at him go. He loves to eat those things. And he loves to eat ghosts. Oh, he ate two of the power pellets by accident. Let's hope that doesn't come back to bite him. Pac-Man having some difficulties. And he eats another ghost. Oh. Oh, Pac-Man has been downed. He was not able to get the cherry. Everybody's going to be very upset with him. Oh, Pac-Man needs to be very careful here. What will he do? Oh, bad idea. Oh, shit. Pac-Man was flanked. Oh, Pac-Man was almost flanked again. All he wants to do is clear the board. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. And he did. Pac-Man moves on to the next board with one life remaining. Look at him gobble up all those little dots. He's a true American hero. That Pac-Man. Oh, and now he's eating ghosts. And a strawberry. Oh, ghosts are on his tail. Pac-Man decides to just eat some pellets instead. Oh, Jesus Christ. Pac-Man knew what he was doing. Oh, and he gets the final power pellet of the board. Eats a ghost. 
Oh, Jesus. Pac-Man is dead. He's back. He's going to eat a lot of more pellets this time. Turning the corner. He's going crazy. I guess his diet will start Monday. He eats two ghosts. Oh, and a cherry. Oh, Pac-Man's in a sticky spot. Damn. Okay. Pac-Man needs the power pellet. Oh, he just needs to get this row. And he's good. He attempts to go down. <laughs> But it's futile. Oh, he has a ghost on his tail. He gets power pellet and takes two down. Oh, shit. Pac-Man has one life left. Let's see if he can utilize it. Ah, he makes it to the third board. Oh, and we see our first cutscene. And it's pretty much what we've been doing the whole time. No new information. Just the same old shit. Pac-Man doing a lot better this time. <laughs> oh, he's cornered. Pac-Man has been defeated. And just like the Super Bowl this year, only two games were played. But that is more than they usually play at the Super Bowl. What a day this has been for sports fans all over the country. They saw a lot of cool shit. Uh, stuff. I hope you all enjoyed the Super Bowl this year. This is Jackie Football, signing off.